introduce yourself and then introduce. <laughs> My name is Neil Bofu, I'm a designer and illustrator, and this is my daughter Natasha. Can you say hi? Okay, I'm going to talk to your dad for a little bit, okay? Go ahead and uh, point out the two illustrations that you have. So I did this illustration here, it's called Lost in the Music. So with these ones I started with a just a regular sketch and then took it into the computer to do a vector illustration. So. With this illustration, I just really wanted to show more, more of just what you feel when you listen to music and just how you can lose yourself in the music. And yeah. It looks like the illustration has a little bit of that Disney influence, but yet it's kind of an alter alternative universe. Yeah. What Disney would be like if, if they weren't constrained by yeah. anything. <laughs> so you want to describe the influences? Um, yeah, actually my dad was a... Uh, my dad was an animator at Disney, so I grew up with him uh, drawing like Fox and the Hound and a lot of that stuff. So I I had a lot of that influence growing up and seeing him drawing those characters, and so I grew up drawing alongside him. So I would say that has uh, probably a lot of influence in the style of my work. Now, did you get a chance to experience that kind of hands-on, old-school animation with cells? And then transition over to digital, or um, yeah, not professionally, but just growing up with everything with my dad, I played around with a lot of like kind of animation and doing little flip books and uh, you know drawing each stage in an animation and trying to flip through it and see how it moved. Uh, so yeah, I started out drawing traditionally, and then I moved into uh, being doing graphic design for work, and so doing more of the digital work and all of that stuff. And then recently I started getting back into doing more traditional artwork and sketching and all that, but then taking it back into the computer to build out more of the final pieces. So kind of mixing the traditional and the uh, digital. And I'm seeing a little bit of a steampunk in place, is that? Yeah. Yeah, so this one's called the Tinker, which uh, was a sketch, started out as a, just a sketch in my sketchbook that I'd done probably three years ago and it was just something in the middle of waiting for files to load at work and just kind of sketching out an idea and then a few months ago I was looking for something new to do for an illustration and I found that sketch in my sketchbook and decided to pull it into the computer and do it more in the uh, kind of digital uh, illustration style but yeah I just had a lot of fun with uh, just kind of bringing a little bit of a simplified uh, style to it. Now, I noticed uh, uh, that the color palette that you're using is pretty muted, so it's not exactly a monotone. Yeah. But uh, you want to describe why or explain why you use that particular style or coloring? Um, I wanted to use really limited colors, and that kind of comes from a little bit of my design background with designing stuff for like screen printing and things like that. So kind of limiting my color palette and thinking about how many screens that would actually involve if I wanted to do a traditional like screen print. And then I like working in kind of a monochromatic style. So um, I like to try and see how much depth in the work I can get with still staying within a certain range of colors. And if uh, people want to see more of your work, how would they any websites, Facebook? Uh, yeah, um, you can just find me as Neil Vilpu, N-E-I-L-V-I-L-P-P-U. Uh, so my website is neilvilpu.com and then pretty much all the social media, you can find me as Neil Vilpu. So like Facebook, Twitter, uh, Snapchat, Instagram, pretty much all of that. Is that a finish or a Uh Finish, yes. Thank you very much. Thank you.